The reason we want to dig into the character of Jesus is that it reveals the Father's character, God's character, and it can wipe out confusion and vagueness about who is God and what he's like? Who am I trusting? So when you have the big crises in life, which is I, I've lost the job, I can't pay the bills, there's stress in relationships, or you know, heaven forbid somebody dies, you can hold on to God because you know what he's like. The more definition you have around his character, because you've seen it in Jesus, the more tenaciously you can hold on to him in faith and really trust him through dark times. Another reason we want to work with the character of Jesus is you begin to figure out his character. And I mean, that's everything from his compassion and humility to his clean anger and fierceness, which when you understand, you love it, to his protection and approachability and the self-control of Jesus. The more you understand that, you walk in the second commandment, life application, because you want to be just like him. And that's different than saying, I remember the day when I thought, I don't want to be humble because the scripture says, you know, the meek will inherit the earth. God gives grace to the humble. But because I saw humility in Jesus and it's so amazing, I, I want to be just like the master. So working in his character actually stimulates obedience from a person rather than principles. And principles are good. We got to have those but there's a higher place and a greater place where we want to be just like him because of who he is. So the more we understand Jesus' character and the fullness of who he is in terms of his compassion, humility, his tenderness, his protection, approachability, his fierce anger when, when there's injustice and he wants to protect someone, it opens up the fullness of the man who went to the cross to bear our sins. And it opens your heart up to respond to him. And so we get to see the fullness of his love in a person versus the concept that, oh, you know, God died for us on the cross. It's just so much more real. And I find that people are really responsive to that. So sharing your faith, evangelism, the Great Commission, discipleship, all that revolves around a person rather than being church principles. So that's, again, why I'm, I'm passionate about talking to the character of Jesus.